I hope you're all having fun. Yep. I'm always. Not. Why not? No, Whoa. Not. That's close. I'm pretty sure you all know the famous YouTuber. PewDiePie. Who doesn't? Who hasn't? What was that? <laughs> this is a real this is a real PewDiePie YouTube video. Alright, swipe off. See there's that, there's that, you go on. There's that, I've actually unsubscribed Ooh, from him now. Okay. See that? I see okay, that. Okay, I'm gonna go on this. I've so you actually just liked the video. Guess! But this is like a meme thing. I don't think I've seen this video. And I didn't know this, but look what video pops up. Look. See, and if you saw Ah, the yeah, I love that video. But here, the Capella video. it says, douche, reply. Next meme, please. My god, that was awful. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, I see why you made this video. Next oh, okay. meme, please. Oh my god, that was awful. <laughs> Great impersonation, my dude. <laughs> you, you prick. Whoa, dude. <laughs> Do I kind okay. Of that? Proper yeah, angry here, yo. Tearing a wee kid's dreams and be famous, what an asshole. Aw, the dude's an got dreams. An asshole. Don't take it to heart, little dude. Don't take it to heart, bro. Oh, he looks genuinely upset. That sucks, dude. Nice beard, you fucking freak. Whoa, dude. There's some hard words, bro. I, I know it's good, not all your videos on um, PewDiePie. That's good, that's, that's dead good. <laughs> this kid cracks me up, bro. Oh my god, I just can't get it anymore. I thought it was going to be good and all. Oh, he actually watches your content, poods. Oh, okay, that ending. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's be serious. Let's talk about this. All right, guys, so as you witnessed there, that was from a young up-and-coming YouTuber named I Do Voices. Now, believe it or not, I actually stumbled upon this kid on Facebook. And the video that actually came up that I absolutely loved, I adored this video, was this one right here. Test your mind. Mortal Kombat! Do, 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 do. Now, as you can see from that video, he done a little bit of an acapella score to the Mortal Kombat theme song. Dude, if you are watching this video, I just want to let you know I loved that video. I thought that was fantastic. And for a kid of your age to actually be able to pull off something like that, like, I don't even know where to begin to pull off an acapella score like that. That was so cool. I loved it. It made me laugh. It made me feel, you know, nostalgic hearing the tune. And you done a great job. That's in my opinion. Now, of course, as you guys have witnessed here, he got really upset because the titan of YouTube, the god of YouTube, as he has been referred to by many others, PewDiePie actually featured him on one of his meme review videos. And it seemed that he's had nothing really good to say. Even though he listened to it for a few seconds, he did say something quite mean. Now, I just want to send this message to you, little dude. I do voices. Um, don't take things that other creators say to heart. Um, it's not a thing that you should take seriously, especially from a YouTuber like PewDiePie. Like, don't get me wrong, PewDiePie is a professional. He is good at what he does. He is not where he is for no reason. There's a reason why he's there. And don't ever take what he says to heart, because at the end of the day, PewDiePie, he likes making jokes. He likes making fun of other people, other YouTubers, famous stars, or whatever. He likes to exploit people. That's what his channel's about now. That's his niche, you know. He transitioned a lot over the years. I've been following this guy for quite some time. And I know how he works. So, as a young kid, as an aspiring YouTuber, as you said yourself, you have a dream to become famous on the platform, which is very ambitious, and it's not an easy thing to do. But go you, bro. Power to you, and keep working it. Keep rocking it. Don't let something like this from a big creator actually scratch that. The biggest creator upset you and stop you from achieving what you want to achieve. And you know, I find quite heartbreaking is your face at the end of this video. You can tell that you're genuinely upset. And it's probably because you looked up to PewDiePie. I mean, you were obviously subscribed to this guy. You said it yourself, you unsubscribed. So seeing somebody that you looked up, look up to kind of bad mouth your video or say something mean, yeah, that can be really disheartening, especially if it's coming from someone 
somebody that you looked up to. Um, I can only imagine how that feels. But honestly, this is just a message to you. And I know this is no relevance to me, this channel or whatever. But I feel like I wanted to address it because I stumbled upon you on Facebook. I liked what you did. I found your YouTube channel. I subscribed to your YouTube channel. And, you know, I like watching small creators and see what they can come out with. Now, if anybody has been here for the longest time, you know that I thrive off supporting other creators, whether you're large or small. I'll always make sure that you get some sort of promotion, you get some sort of help from me if I can do that. Because being a YouTuber, it, it's very relatable seeing people struggle. It's very relatable seeing other creators trying to succeed because I've been there and I'm still trying to succeed I'm by no means a successful youtuber so a message to you bro don't take these things to heart you know keep pushing forward chase your dreams that you have and keep uploading the content you love to do don't let others push you down and like I said PewDiePie he's a professional he does these things he say these things because it's a part of what he does it's called his creativity this is how he makes jokes and this is why people you know tend to like his videos and I am actually, you know, quite proud of PewDiePie being more honest in these videos now and being more himself, you know, because he had admitted months ago that before the old PewDiePie was a lie, he wasn't truly himself, he was just giving crazy reactions for views, uh, but now he's himself, and yes, sometimes he can be brutally honest, sometimes he can be a little bit harsh, but that's just who he is, and don't ever take that to heart, my little dude. I liked what you did, I loved that video, I would like to suggest doing more videos like that one, maybe another theme song, maybe Pokemon, maybe Power Rangers, I know you gotta do, just do these things and you will get the views, you will get people that come in to appreciate for what you do and for being you, so don't ever be disheartened by that. that that's kind of why I wanted to make this video, you know, I was kind of sitting on my couch and I was watching YouTube, your video popped up because I was subscribed to your channel and I seen that it was to do with PewDiePie and the fact that he did actually insert you into his video, which you should actually be happy about because I would like to be in a PewDiePie video, whether it's a negative thing or a positive thing. It would just be cool to be featured in one of the YouTubers that I aspired to be when I was starting this platform, you know? So, be something to be proud of that you're integrated into his videos. Whether or not it is negative, you know, just, just be happy, you know, and keep using that fuel to thrive forward and become better at what you do, little dude. I like what you do. I want to see more of what you got. I know you're still very, very small, but I see success in you my little dude so keep doing it keep rocking and keep plowing out the videos here on YouTube now of course like I said guys if you're watching my subscribers this is totally out of the ordinary this is not something that I usually do um, but when I see something like I want to talk about give my thoughts on it I do that you guys are familiar with that so I will do that no matter what it is even this is completely off topic and off niche I like to talk about these things and give my opinion especially to fellow creators out there big or small so, I do voices, if you're watching, you got love from me and many others out there, I can see you're getting close to 10,000 subscribers, so dude, you must be doing something right, keep rocking the videos, and keep doing what you love, because that's all that matters at the end of the day, right here on YouTube. Anyway guys, that's all I have to say, stay tuned for more videos coming very soon on the channel, we're gonna get more 7 Deadly Sins out, we're gonna get some more um, Hunter x Hunter related videos in the future, I know you guys enjoyed my latest one that I done on the 135 episode build up, and we've got more things coming, I'm bringing Sonic back to the channel as well, so that's something to look forward to, and of course, the next episode of My Hero Academia drops tomorrow morning, so get yourselves plus ultra and hype for that video as it will drop very early as I am off tomorrow from work. Anyway guys, that's all I have to say. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you like what I had to say and support to this little guy. His link is in the description below. I don't think I need to put Poodleboy's link there. You already know who he is. But I do voices. Link is in the description below. Show him love. Say I sent you and tell him about this video just so he gets the word and knows that I care of what he had to say. Anyway guys, like I said, that ends it here and as always, stay geeky, stay cool, be awesome, and be happy and I'll see you dudes in my next video. See you later, dudes!